Hey, Conscious Endeavors, Jonathan. Talking about the light and the dark. The polarity. Jesus is the white side of the yin-yang. The devil is the black side of the yin-yang. The idea in life is to create the perfect balance and equanimity. For a long time, we want to fight the bad side bad side wants to fight the good side and vice versa but at the end of the day we have to realize that the demon has to become best friends with the angel when you experience your duality when you experience the light and the dark both sides You see where the gauge is and how far you should go. And you can choose for yourself which side you want to be on. Or if you want to be equanimous and balanced. And the key is to reach a peace. That's a perfect equanimity and balance. Peace. If you have any emotion or frequency that's running through you that is anything but love or high vibration then you have to learn how to switch your energy immediately so you can neutralize the negative frequencies so It's good to know how to neutralize the negative frequencies so you could bring yourself back to a neutral position and point so you don't have to swarm and spiral in that depression. Put on a beautiful piece of music. Pick up an instrument and play. Hang out with a best friend or a family member. Do something that you love to switch the energy from negative to positive instantaneously within seconds. Everything is thought. So try to control the thought. Try to neutralize the negative thought. Try to maximize the positive thought. If you're in fear frequency, you can never be abundant and you escalate your liver enzymes. So you're more susceptible to illness and disease. So if you're in a fear frequency, you're not gonna be successful. Why do you think they put 90% of the media, uh, why do you think all of it's fear-based? It's for control reason. So people can be complacent sheep. When you're in a fear frequency, you shrink your electromagnetic field around you and you're more susceptible for control and being controlled and basically you're the sheep. The objective is to become the God. We are all God. You are God. I am God. Everything is God. You created all of this. It's a co-collaboration of collective consciousness, is what this is. It's a collective dream. Roll, roll, roll your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. I heard that song and it makes a lot of sense. <laughs> Did you ever think to yourself, what is this place? <laughs> Did you ever think to yourself, why is this place so hard? Did you ever think to yourself, why is this realm seem impossible at times? Well, if you knew all the answers to the test, would you learn anything? If somebody gave you the answers to the test, would you learn anything? Ask yourself that question. a game 
You create it how you want. You are the creator. In order to create, you have to stay in a high frequency. That's optimal for production and for creation from my experience. Although there were times that I was in a lower frequency and I was very abundant and I was very inspired and I was able to create. So you have to find that balance and what's best for you, what works for you. But if you're put in a fear frequency, you shrink your electromagnetic field. If you're in a love frequency, you expand your electromagnetic field three to five meters. So I'm told, so I hear. When you expand your electromagnetic field, you're more powerful and that's when you attract and that's when you create at your finest. So it took me 38 years to realize these simple things. Why is it that they don't teach us this in school? Huh? Why is it that they don't teach you these things in college? Ask yourself that question. Why don't they teach us very valuable things in school that we need to learn that are conducive to life? Remember, in order to get out of your negative frequency, try to do something you love. Change your mind off of that. Everything is thought. Everything is thought. Life is mental. Everything that's inside of you, you start to see in your external reality. Everything that's outside of you is also inside of you. As above, so below. So remember, if you want to change your energy from negative to positive, do something you love, change your thought. Don't spiral downward. Don't keep drinking that alcohol. Don't keep doing the drugs if you're feeling like crap. Change your thought immediately. Otherwise, you continue to spiral. Trust me, I'm the master. <laughs> so change your thought from negative to positive by doing something you love, by talking to someone you love, by changing your activity. And that will help you be the best creator that you can be. Conscious Endeavors.